Welcome once again to the garage of perpetual cold, apparently. According to that man there. Is it cold? Is it cold? Freezing. It's freezing. Um, and today we're tackling, or you can't see it now because it's stood in the way, um, this, this bit of, of Jenny here. So yes, round, round the boot lock, um, a little bit of the boot lid where I accidentally got loads of grey overspray on it. Um, but yes, so it's time for base coat and lacquer today. Um, I'll I'll, show, I'll turn the camera around and show you. I don't know what he's doing, but um, it's this bit that we're painting, and this bit, and probably a bit of this bit. Oh, no, there's a bit I forgot. I've left at home that I could have done with bringing. Bloody I'll have to bring it later. Hmm? What? I'm not telling you. So yeah, cracking on this, hopefully by the end of today, that, that should be all painted. Lacquer should be on. And then when it's all dried up I can put lock back in at number plate back on. They want lacquer as well, don't they? Oh and he's not done this bit yet either. <coughs> we've done it. No, it's you've not lacquered it. You've not done it yet, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. We've got our wheel. I don't think there's no lacquer on this, is there? No. No. So we've got our wheel that's just it's not being lacquered, that's just the, the grey alloy paint. Um and then I brought the other ones that we need to this one's not too bad on top. Uh, but the ones underneath you can see is a bit a bit scabby down there. Will it focus down there? But anyway, they're a bit scabby, so they need flattening off. Um, and then we can we can crack on with them. One freshly lacquerized shiny wheel. Come and have a look at it on camera. Oh, it's busy. Um, as I said, and I say this every time, when you film stuff that you've just painted, it looks amazing, but it doesn't always look like that in real life. So just bear with it. Just bear with it when you see the final results and you go, well that looks shit. It's just, it's just lacquering that bit now. Real as it happens action. We're just waiting for this to dry. All the green. See that bit on the camera there? That's looking, looking good. That bit there looks way greener than what it does in real life. It's, uh, what's it like to touch? I don't know, I'm not touching it yet. Look, and when you look at wheels, look how shiny and professional that looks. <laughs> Which is shiny and professional. Mm. Well, shiny. Just waiting for this to... to dry oh you can see it's drying now look oh it's a bit disappearing um that wheel's got some paint and lacquer on it so that one's all right this one's got some primer on it which is going to be is it going to be runny somewhere it'll rub down yeah. and then these two need need flat wheeling uh still but you can tell the difference between colors when you see them there like that's the that's that silver sparkle color and then that's what we're doing so it is darker um, but yeah we need to prime this up uh, let that dry and then what time is it may it be dinner time by then what do you think I think it should be easily we've painted this bit what do we think to this bit it's alright it's a lot better than, uh, than it was mm. that's very shiny there shiny. it focuses on the shiny
must be 30. And it would just blow. Obviously, nobody likes it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to drive this car into a concrete block or some of them. Yeah. You know, like old films like Speed of Earth. Yeah. They're so driving along. They just hit this block. And he just took, he just lifted straight out of the car and fell on the floor. <laughs> in the same position, there was sat one who were driving it. <laughs> yeah. It was so bizarre. You just bang, whoop, bump, oh, yeah. Is it dead? No. Yeah. <laughs> All primed up and ready for action. There, yeah, just looks very grey, doesn't it? So next job will be to put in that bag, in that bucket there. There's some paint warming up, so we'll be putting green on top of it. Hopefully by the end of today, I can put lacquer on, and uh, it'll be done. So we've painted that grey stripe in now, so in theory this bit's done. Go around here, we painted that bit up. Um that's that's a bit snotty around there, but we'll gloss over that. Uh, you can't see them with number plates on. Um I've put one of them in. Um see so yeah, there's a bit of over spray and stuff that we need to compound out. Um I started spraying this, but then it started going all stripey, so I tried it the other way, then it went all stripey. And then we had another go at this bit, but then it started to run. And we've only got a tiny bit of paint left in that can, uh, so we need to get some more paint. Oh, there we are. We need to get some more paint um, and have another go on that. Um, so, yeah, hopefully that'll, that'll come out. It looks worse now than it did the last coat I put on. So... My my learning from that is to go is to go this way when you're spraying it rather than that way. It seems easier to get a consistent consistent line if you go that way. Uh, but there you go. Uh, we've done one wheel. I think I showed you already down there. I've got another wheel down there that we've rectified the prime part on that's ready to paint. And um, but. Yeah, it's coming along. I think we just need to get... This is the sticking point now, the spoiler. As soon as the... Why am I all dark again? As soon as the spoiler's done, I can bolt that up. Um, and then I can start putting bits of boot back together on inside. And then that'll move some of the crap out of boot and stuff. Annoyingly, I'll show you this. Annoyingly, these have come out patchy. And it, I don't know whether it's because I didn't put enough enough colour on when I did them first time but I don't know where you can tell they're all they're all patchy they look like they're dusty in fact they might be dusty actually I doubt it but I'm out I'm on hanging on to that onto that hope you can't really I can't tell with my eyes I can't tell on this side but on camera I can see it more um I've got the dormer to put on when everything else is done um yeah once the wheels are painted up I'll get some and I've got some pennies, I'll get some tyres put on. I think the 205 is from what I can tell. Um, so tyres on there, wheels on there. It'll, it'll, it'll soon be done, it'll soon be done. And then it'll be on its, on its wheels. Um, and then it'll be back over to, to my house. And then I'll have to start stripping interior out, cleaning everything up. Fixing them door cards, changing the colours of the bits I want to change. Uh, the main thing is fixing them door cards and putting seats in. Everything else can be done individually as and when. But uh, yeah, I'm a bit annoyed about that that spoiler. I'm sure if I had just done it again, done another coat up and down rather than a crossways, that a bit have been better. But there we go. Not even because it's just the shininess, isn't it? It's not the green. 
just the shininess. Maybe it looks all right. We'll, we'll lacquer them, but we'll 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 see. So thank you for watching another Jenny update. Um, yeah, not else to add other than it's, it's feel like a bit of a a slog at the moment. It's like we we get we get so far and then some some of fights as like paint or something. Uh, but I think we've I think we've done a fair crack for how long we've been going on to do it. I'll have to have a look back when the when I put the videos out. I'm sure it's only been like two or three weeks or something. There was talk there was talk of uh, of trying to trying to get Jenny ready for Rustyville. Um but I'm not sure she would be ready for Rustyville. And she didn't at least need to be on lowered springs by then. An ideal head gasket done. Um, don't know if I if I if I manage to sell Margaret before then then we should be good to go. That that'll be fine. But uh, fingers crossed. Otherwise otherwise Henny will have to go out for a trip. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to click like, subscribe, leave a comment, and share with your friends. And also, oh, I've got silicon on me. Uh, and also with your enemies, because if your enemies watch this, they might like um, not be your enemies anymore, which would be nice, wouldn't it? So thank you for watching. Take care. See you soon. And bye.